good morning so today is december 28th and we are moving i'm actually about to head to go and get the keys to my new place right now so i'm already like dressed up or whatever here comes zane <laughs> just trotting in here so yes i'm dressed up and i'm about to go and get these keys super excited but you guys i'm not even gonna lie i feel like it's okay because i have this allergic reaction i don't even know if you can see but it's like legit mm. do y'all see it it's like a little it's like all these little bumps right here on my face and eyes like it's all over but i don't feel well but we're gonna move okay oh dang way I don't know when this vlog will actually go up, but I just kind of want to vlog, you know, the process here and there so you guys can see, you know, the moving process. But yeah, very much excited and cannot wait. Have a lot of boxes here. Bam. Okay, the couch is gone. Boxes here boxes over there so yeah it's a lot of boxes here um i still need to take down my christmas tree and i think that's pretty much it and you know just some few things here and there i'm just gonna carry some items over in my car as well so yeah the movers actually come tomorrow which is tuesday the 29th um but i'm just gonna carry like you know the small things things that are like sentimental to me so yeah all right I see all right my tv is up they just came and did the tv which i am so happy about but yeah so this is this space for like right now and i just can't wait to show y'all this whole space like whenever it comes together so right now i'm about to go and get something to eat and then i'm going to my nail appointment at three o'clock it's like almost two something right now then i'm going back to my old apartment get some more carry car carry stuff and bring it here and i think that will be the last trip for today and then um <clears throat> i think yeah and then tomorrow will be the movers they will actually move in and all the big stuff and i'll actually be seeing the night in my new apartment for the first time tomorrow but yeah i'm about to go ahead and head over because your girl got a headache and i've been really busy all day so good morning you guys so it is december 31st is 9 45 a.m and i am headed to drop off the keys at my old apartment so i can be done with that i am so 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 excited i am so stressed you guys like i would love to tell you i don't know if i want to do a get ready with me or if i want to do like just a story time here on the vlog i mean it's not like anything you know dramatic or whatever but i would love to tell you like what i've been going through the past like few days because it has been super super duper stressful and um i had like an allergic reaction i had posted this on my twitter and if you are not following me on my twitter make sure you follow me um i will leave a link down below or whatever so you can kind of just keep up because like whenever i'm not on youtube or like posting videos you can keep up with me on twitter like you know I, i'm trying to be like more active on there but yes so um i had an allergic reaction um i'm not gonna bring it like too close to my face but you can still still kind of see it i'm like getting over it now but it was i think like because i was so stressed the past like few days since like the moving started that it was just you know really taking a toll on me but either way it goes i'm gonna tell you guys about that later but yes i'm headed to clean well my apartment is already clean um i actually hired this cleaning service but and they did a good job but they just kind of missed like certain things um which i'm going back just to clean the um valley trash can and also clean the um stove or whatever before i turn in the keys a little money order for their like final payment you know da, 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 little things like that or whatever so i'm doing that and then i'm going to um start kind of unpacking some things or whatever so so this is what this vlog will kind of consist of a little bit um decorating and things like that so this is what my vlogs will consist of probably for the next like mm, few weeks months or whatever um really the main thing my camera's about to die but really the main thing that i have to kind of like get things for for is kind of like the living room because i no longer have my couch you guys know i'm like looking for a new sectional but um 
the kitchen room i mean the kitchen room <laughs> the uh living room a little bit like in the kitchen area and that's really it because every and then i'm looking for a new like dresser for my uh, bedroom but everything else like my beauty room slash studio recording room blah 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 like all of that it's like pretty much all together um because i purchased all that furniture or whatever and everything from that uh, room went over and then i'm looking for a new entryway table so i don't really have much to get um but you know just trying to make it very much homey so yeah, I just wanted to come and update you guys because it's like literally been a like a busy, busy, busy like last three days or whatever. But I'm super excited. Like once I once I turn in the keys, I'm gonna pick up some packages, head to the storage, um, go grocery shopping, pick up some things for Zane so he can um because he needs some like food and things like that. And then I'm gonna come back and like I said, start unpacking and things like that. Um, I think I brought my extra battery, so we're good. Um, hopefully it's charged. But either way it goes, like yeah, um, it's just been so busy so hectic and I cannot wait to um, kind of update you guys and you know kind of like you know let you in a little bit give you a little here and there or whatever all right you guys so I made it back to the apartment and I'm actually in my new studio room I'm super excited to get it together it is really empty this is my vanity I don't even have anything here on the walls yet but it's looking really really bright in here so I'm super excited to get it together um, let's see today was like really interesting i don't know what time it is but um i'm about to work on this room right now not because i want to because i'm actually quite tired like i literally have been on the go the past few days and it's been such a stressful stressful day um excuse me it's been a stressful week okay it's new year's eve i'm trying to get these things together um, so I can start recording next week because I have a lot of videos that I need to do um, So I just kind of need this room like up and ready um, Just at least with what I already have you know what I mean and um, So yeah, we're gonna get that done. Y'all I had such a stressful week Oh my god, like everything that went everything that could have possibly went wrong during a move went wrong okay so i'm gonna explain that to you guys later we're gonna go ahead and get started i'll show you bits and pieces but of course you gotta wait until i do like the full okay the full beauty room tour or whatnot now i know i was supposed to don't come for me sis okay i know i was supposed to do it like months ago okay please do not come for me i promise you okay i promise you i'm going to do one for you guys like i promise you i am i think i got groceries so i need to like put some groceries up first. Told you you so extra, but I know I'm the same. Me in spite of my trauma, give me what I need instead of the drama. Cause when it pop off, it's like, oh my, all good all day, but the night we be going so hard on the flip side. So tell me, we'll be on a day, babe. I could keep that same energy when you go low, I go low too. But you'd rather stay high, I know you. Can we stay high, babe? Rather be on that way, tryna control our emotions. If we on a rise out of passion, we can share love in the ocean. But if you wanna go insane, either way, baby, we could go all night. We could do it all night. We could go all night, all night. Do we heal? Do we bleed? I'ma follow your lead, but we could go all night. All of my calls go to voicemail I block you so I don't raise hell Should've talked through it in detail Our separate ways ain't gon' end well No But when we get back, it's like, oh my All bad all day, but the night I Get that good, good till we act right So tell me where we on the day, babe I could keep that same energy When you go low, I go low too You'd rather stay high, I know you Can we stay high, babe? I'd rather be on that wave Tryna control our emotions If we on a rise out of passion We can 
share love in the ocean But if you wanna go insane either way, baby, we could go on We could do it all night We could go all night, all night Do we heal, do we bleed, I'ma follow your lead We could go all night I've been calm, cool, collected, but you pushing on my nerves And I'm knowing your intention, I'm under pressure Okay, I'm admitting that a couple things I said Got acidic in the tone and the presence, I get careless Long as you know, I come with imperfections When you look at me, you see the soul through my flesh You something special Know you looking bomb, the way you dress it gone Flex it, hold it still and let my mind digest You got the leverage, you got the upper handle on the situation You worthy of a million more of the storms that we weather We fight retreating this, but you trying to kill the cycle When nobody's stressing that body like me, I know the way you like it I treat you like a queen, run the castle, you a treasure huh? Feel like you setting fire to my desire for the pleasure You a gem, got me blim, let's make amends No, you can't, I'm out here Trying to control our emotions If we on the right side of passion We can share love in the ocean But if you wanna go insane either way, baby We could go on We could go all night We could go all night Do we heal, do we bleed, I'ma follow yo then that side is not centered but if it's if it's left like this I have access to both outlets if you can see I have access to this outlet and this outlet right here if it's left like that but so tell me what you guys think like let me know like should I leave it should I leave it like this let me know. I've been staring at the telephone cuz when you're gone I miss your face. Later clock, body talk. There's no need to bring it up. Nothing you say makes it better.
all right you guys so this is how my desk looks so far i cannot even remember for the life of me um how i had it i think i'm feeling this you know i really like this definitely going to get another chair but i'm actually going to get another chair that is um kind of like this gold would you call this gold or bronze or brass somewhere in that family the only reason why i'm saying gold or brass because the mirror right here which this is not going to go huh? look it's so crazy this mirror right here it says that it has like a brass finish and that's what the other i think the, the other one is more gold the last thing i'm going to work on will be this wall right here and this i want to be like my recording wall um i'm not exactly sure what i want to do with it just yet but i have an idea you know i'm gonna put this lamp over here for right now Take it away, feeling too good to me Chilling all day, all in your space is where I wanna be Here in this room, what did you do? I just can't get enough Too caught up in your love I've been trying to forget But you won't let me Something in my brain wants you I've been hanging by myself Asking for help, but nothing seems to work on you. Yeah, you, you always make me feel like oh yeah, you. You never leave my thoughts alone. Yeah, you, you're the reason I'm going out of my mind. I just can't stop thinking about you. so i made it back home i got my sushi i'm gonna show you what i got i got like king salmon and then um kind of like a shrimp tempura i don't know if you can see but that's what it looks like oh i can't wait i actually had this is some expensive <laughs> sushi okay but i had the shrimp tempura um yesterday right I had it yesterday and it was so good so <laughs> had to get it again or whatever so we have sushi and you know it's new year's eve okay so i got wine and i got champagne um i have this barefoot because i don't really drink like that but because it's new year's why not but i have this moscato again something very sweet because i don't drink like that i need to wash a little glass or something but yes i actually have a wine cooler and i'm gonna let it chill for a little bit more but we're gonna open this okay we're gonna open this to the new year do apartment your girl feeling good blessed happy yes it has tempura shrimp avocado topped with spicy crab micro chives and spicy aioli and then this one here that's on the left side which looks so good look at this sushi yes this one is called the Salmon King, and it is spicy king crab, cucumber, house smoked salmon, yuzu, mayo, and tobiko. Tobiko? I don't know. But anyway, that's how that is. Looks so good. All right, it is almost New Year's. I have my wine glass. I have the Moscato. 28 seconds. A little bit. Here you go. I'm not gonna do much. That's all I can do. Three, two, one. Happy New Year, Design Squad. Happy New Year. <laughs> Say Happy New Year to the people. Say, wait, look. Happy New Year. Happy New Year. I'm looking really rough or whatever, but we are in the house for New Year's. Um. So yes, this Moscato is actually really good. Mm.
later 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 i still like i said wanted to kind of like record every chance i get you know the process of me you know doing whatever so um yeah happy new year you guys i hope that you guys had a great great new year's eve um you are safe and um i'm wishing everyone well 2021 okay so let's be on our game 2021 don't slack let's make sure that we're sticking to our goals and you know that we doing it okay but anyway so this is how i'm looking today and um that's that i'm not doing much today um ugh, let me show you guys my nails come on focus focus y'all see these so it's like the little ombre it's not ombre what is this i don't know the different colors like i have the white tip right here and then like you know like kind of neutral colors so yes girl i'm tired all right so we are in my new closet here sorry i don't even have on a bra <laughs> all right so we're in my new closet and i'm about to do some unboxing um of my master closet so i'll be able to you know start getting back into the swing of things i'm not exactly sure how much footage I'm going to get because I think my camera is about to die but yes yeah, so I'm about to unbox and I have I feel like I had like the same amount of space I don't know it's just probably like is a little bit different but I have so much like just to show you guys so when you walk in like here is um what do you would call this like this little built-in um cabinetry cabinet space or whatever um my bathroom is smaller as i was telling you guys um so i have my hamper in here which my hamper was in my other bathroom but it cannot fit in my bathroom but moving forward so i have this space right here and then i have all of that space all of this space as well and then i have all of this space and then i have my mirror right here so i am going to play around with it and just kind of see like how i want things i know for sure i do want like all of my bottoms to go right here that is like you know skirts and um joggers jeans pants trousers whatever you want to call them like all down here and then i know all of my longer items because it just makes sense to go like right here this one is a long space as well but like i stated i'm going to have my hamper there um so it's not gonna be too long or whatever so i can get some stuff right here but not too long so i'm trying to figure out how i want to do it like do i want blazers right here do i want blazers over there like you guys know i'm bad <laughs> I wish I still had sections, which it does show me like, hey, a little section right here, a section, and then a section. So it's giving me that like, you know, instead of just like a long feel, it's giving me sections, but I don't know exactly like how I want it just yet. Just to be honest with you, I'm going to do this up like really, really cute. I don't know what I want to do with it, but I still want it to look, you know, aesthetically pleasing. I'm not a big fan of the hamper. 
being in here. I can put the hamper in my beauty room bathroom because I actually have, um, I actually have like more room in the beauty room bathroom than I do. Sorry, you guys, I'm trying to set it up. And the lighting is so horrible in here. I mean, it's a closet, so I'm sorry. But um, I actually have more room space in my beauty room bathroom than I do in here. Yeah, <sighs> I don't know. I mean, you know, so I don't know. Or whatever. All that I crave when you're away, nights are sleepless. Do we need space? Yeah, maybe you're brave. Boy, you're my weakness. Giving we take the love that we make. It's my favorite drug. Caught up in your love I've been trying to forget But you won't let Right, you guys, good afternoon It is 3.24 p.m. And I am headed to um, <clears throat> Ashley Furniture well, I'm headed to some furniture stores Not just Ashley Furniture um, But I'm also going to Target Um I just gotta get like some little household cleaning supplies. It's gonna be really quick because I actually got like a late start um, to the day. So hopefully I can just be in and out. Um, and then I have to come back because I need to get ready, which I'm not gonna do much. I was going to like just be natural like what I am now, but I may like just do my eyelashes and I may put some eyelashes on and do my eyebrows. Um, but um earl's birthday was on the 31st and he's having like a little dinner tonight at six so i am going to go to dinner at six. all right i am headed to um ruru tacos and um i didn't put on any makeup as you can see because i was running late i just wanted to be natural like, i didn't want to put on no makeup um because I just don't be, I'm not feeling like it. Like I haven't been in the mood to like really, I haven't been in the mood to really just get done up or whatever. And plus I'm still um, recovering from an allergic reaction. So this is what it's gonna get. I did change my outfit. I'll see you guys in a little bit. Okay. Yes, lady. Tap water. It's the birthday boy. Hello. Wait a minute. I gotta focus. I gotta. Okay. All right. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Tell me when. Okay. Wait a minute. I'm ready. Okay. I'm ready. It's the birthday boy. Ooh. Ooh. Yes. Let's get into the fit. This is this is a birthday new line. fit. Okay. What is it called? Not available. <laughs> Not available. <laughs> no. Look. Sure, no. Yes. Wow, oh, luxury, little snuff. Voila. Okay. Magic. <laughs> <laughs> All right, good morning, you guys. So, let me go and get some lip gloss. All right, good morning, you guys. It is January 4th, and it is Monday. So we're starting the Monday off very, very much productive. I am actually at one hole right now with um, my furniture, the company that I ordered my furniture from. Um, I ordered furniture yesterday, but I actually want to modify it and um, add an additional piece to the furniture. So I am on hold. I literally been on hold for an hour and seven minutes trying to get to someone. I mean, it is a Monday and it is super busy um, or the call volume is high. Everything is on like back order and it's taking a long time. So I guess a lot of people are calling to inquire about their furniture or whatever i don't know girl but yeah i've been on the phone for about an hour and 10 minutes now so i haven't got to anyone yet and i'm still waiting i've been on the phone for at least the past two hours with my old apartment and now i'm on the phone with this furniture company so i've had like a pretty productive morning i'm actually about to go to my p.o box to um, pick up some packages i need to ship these packages to the giveaway winners for my 200k on instagram so i'm doing that today and um 
just continuing to unpack, um, get my beauty room slash studio together so I can go ahead and, you know, start making some content for you guys. And um, what else I need to do today? Oh, and I really, really want to do my vision board. Like, yes, it's four days until the year, so I really want to get that done. But a lot of people said, like, you know, today is the official, you know, New Year day, okay? Like, this is when you start doing everything that you need to do. Today, the fourth, is like my first day of the new year, okay? Because the weekend, like, ugh, you know what I mean? I really want to set like a routine, like a morning and night routine, a workout routine, you know? And I'm not like trying to like work out, work out, but I'm just trying to like, you know, tone the body a little bit, you know, like get a little bit fit. Look, like I want bam, bam, bam. I want to be thick, you know what I mean? Grab that, honey. Like I went ahead and Girl, I thought <laughs> I thought they were about to answer the phone. I'm like, damn, like it's taking so long. I'll test it out probably sometime. No, I do apologize for your wait time. How may I assist you today? Good afternoon, Danielle. Um, no problem. So I placed an order yesterday. Um. On all right, so I just got my furniture updated and I added an additional piece that I needed. And um, now it's saying March 16th for the delivery instead of <laughs> March 13th, which is okay. It is what it is, girl. So let me show y'all really quick this planner that I got for 2021. And it says, what did it say? She believes she could, so she, did they got a lot of cuss words when i say a lot of cuss words in here they have a lot of cuss words in here um but it is very motivational um i love you know it's a, it has humor to it as well it has like a whole bunch of like stickers and i don't know about you guys but i love 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 using like stickers i don't know it just helps me kind of like stay on track add a little bit of character to my um planner and things like that so I got that. This is my new planner for 2021. I actually got this, if you are interested in it, I actually got this from Second and Charles. Um, yeah, here in Charlotte. So yeah. All right, let's go ahead and get started. All right, you guys. So we need to do a little, a little update. So this is just an update on the beauty room. Um, I have this set up so far. Okay. I have this set up so far. I'm not exactly sure if I'm going to keep it like this, but so far this is what works for me and I really am feeling it. Um, this right here is the Laxia from Ikea. Um, now it is not, let me sh shut the door so I can step back. So it's like really close to the door, but it gives me a nice space because here's the door stopper. So I can definitely comfortably walk in and you know, it's not blocking my way. Um, so I have like my Forever Mood candles that I bought. All of them are in there. So I just have them at the bottom just to kind of like distribute the weight. Now I may more than likely um, do something different with this. But my goal is to get like maybe one of those little things to put to the wall. You can't even see it but one of those things to put to the wall to kind of like hold it here. Like, I don't know what you would call it, like an anchor or something. I know what it looks like, but I don't know what it's called. So like, it can be as secure as possible. So yeah, that's that. Um, I plan to get that together. And then this is my uh, clothing rack. Again, I'm gonna give y'all all the details, you know, in my beauty room tour, which I promise you guys, I am doing one this time i promise you i am so this is like how this looks so far this right here i am going to like i'm thinking that this is going to be like my recording area i'm not exactly sure this right here will be where the chair is going i ordered that chair from target and then whenever i'm recording i'm probably going to just kind of move it out the way and this will be the area that i'm recording on um i'm not exactly sure just yet okay i have to play around with it this is my mirror, my full length mirror, which I love so much. Um, I'm scared because it's on, last time it was on carpet, it did not go anywhere. This time it's on this like hardwood, whatever type of floor. Um, so I'm kind of scared <laughs> right now. 
now so i just have like the bubble wrap or whatever still on there because it gives it a little bit of like texture so it won't slide um i plan to put like you know a vase right there with pompous grass because your girl is on this pompous grass right now so i plan to do that my chair adding like little knickknacks here and there so i cannot wait till everything comes together all right you guys so i am headed to the p.o box so i can pick up a package i'm not exactly sure if i have a few but i'm going to pick up a few packages and then i am going to mail off these package um here to the giveaway winners so i finally got all everybody's address so i'm gonna do that i'm probably going to head to just a few home stores to get some things together yeah, i really didn't want to like i really wanted to get everything like um things out of boxes and situated before i bring in like new things um because like it looks really crowded for me good morning beautiful people it is january 5th and it's tuesday um i know i started vlogging yesterday and I said that I was, and I said that I was going to go to a few stores, but I actually did not go <laughs> anywhere. Like it took so long in the post office because I had to like package the um, giveaway winner stuff, and when I packaged them, it took so long. Like it was a long line. Um, I had to repackage. Um, it, it was just a mess. So it just took so long there where I was just like over it. And I just wanted to come back home. And like I told you guys yesterday, I just really didn't feel comfortable like buying new stuff until I got everything that I needed to get like situated in here first. Like I started on my master closet, but I have not finished that. I've only unboxed one box out of like, I think four large boxes. I'm dreading, like literally, dreading doing that the beauty room was pretty much easy even though i'm still like on the fence about some things in the beauty room i may have to switch some things around but at least things are out of the boxes and put on to you know put into their respective places okay probably like another week i will be like fully situ situated um and then i can go out and like start buying things or whatever this is the candle that i'm going to burn i'm actually going to take it out of this because oof, that was for christmas and <laughs> it's not giving me the vibe that i'm going for so y'all my hands are so ashy like what did i just do this is legit my favorite candle here and it is vanilla bean um from bath and body works is it focusing i'm gonna see how these candles burn in here because my ceilings are still pretty high, like the last apartment. But, all right, we're seeing what Zane is doing. Zane Wayne. <laughs> Good morning. It's not even morning. I'm just, oh, it's afternoon. It's still early. Good afternoon, baby. Hey. Hey, sweet man. Can my, oh. Hey. Hey, sweet man. Hey, sweet man. Hey, sweet Zang Wang. All right, so here's how my closet is looking. It is looking in this portion. Do not mind. It looks a mess. Um, but this is how it looks so far. <laughs> And it is, I have such a hard time. Like, I just feel like people just have that ability. Like, I feel like I can decorate and make a space look really nice. But when it comes to organizing, I cannot do that whatsoever. Like, I'm not even going, like, I'm not even going to lie or flex. Like, I can't do it. And I just have a hard time organizing clothes in a closet. Like, maybe it's because I have too many colors in my closet like that's probably what it is like i'm not afraid of color <laughs> this is how it's looking you know like i got all my blazers here in the back or whatever like this is how it was looking so far but it's not done still like i hate it i hate it <laughs> Let me something in my brain holds you i've been hanging by myself asking for help but nothing seems to work on you yeah So 
this is my breakfast, you guys. Seasoning, that's like Cajun seasoning. So this is the breakfast or whatever. It might not be looking good for some, but it's fine. The bedroom, as I would say, is pretty much complete. I do have a few things that I need to get um, here and there. So this is just how the bedroom looks so far. So the vibe that I'm trying to give is just kind of like hotel vibe. Something where I feel like I'm on vacation each and every time like I come in. It's only noon right now, but y'all, when I tell you it be beaming, like the sun, like the light in here is ridiculous. Like uh, You can even see like so far how much light is coming through and the sun ain't even hitting yet. This is Zane's cage is not going to stay here but you have to follow my homepage or whatever like I said if you really want like details and like direct links or whatever I'll try to do all that here though okay I don't leave my you know YouTube family hanging I have this one pillow right here which again I need to get another one so I got it but they only had one and I was like baby I need this pillow <laughs> So I just went ahead and picked it up and I tried to go online, but they are not selling it whatsoever online or whatever. So I'm going to try and go to a few other, they said it's not available in any other targets or whatnot. And the pillow seemed very popular. It was only $10 and I promise you, I know it may lose its shape over time, but I promise you it feels so good. And I've been sleeping a little bit better with that pillow. So I just got it and I just put it right there. But I plan to get another pillow. And y'all, I am sitting on my um, <laughs> balcony furniture for right now. <laughs> because, um, yeah, I don't have a couch. I'm waiting on my couch. Zane Wayne. Hey, Zane Wayne. Yes, hey, sweet me. Good afternoon. It is about five o'clock. It is J13, okay? So it is my Founder's Day. Happy Founder's Day to all my sorors. In case you don't know, I'm in a sorority, Delta Sigma Theta Sorority Incorporated. It's our Founder's Day. Sun is hitting, but it ain't hitting in the right place because your girl looks super duper rough. But um, I've been trying to get a lot of work done today. I woke up early this morning and I've honestly just been trying to unpack and like organize because I still just kind of feel like all over the place or whatever. So I feel like I got some things done, but yeah, that's that. I just got this package. It's my console table. So I'm about to show you guys that. And um, what else? What else, what else, what else? What else am I gonna do? Oh, and then once I finish that, I'm gonna try and do a little bit more work and then I'm going to um, get ready because um, we're having a Founders Day celebration at one of my sister's house that's um, close by. So it's just like kinda, it's gonna be small because it's just gonna be people that are, you know, in the area. So I'm gonna get ready for that. I need to go pick up wings. I ordered 50 wings um, because we're gonna be working on like vision boards, having cocktails and eating and things like that. So, you know j13 stuff okay period um no but seriously so i'm gonna go and get wings and stuff and like trying to get myself together because baby all right so this right here is my um well this is like the color and texture of the console table i am so excited it looks fairly easy to put together so you know we're gonna make something work you never leave my thoughts alone yeah you you're the reason Just can't stop thinking about you You got me feeling some type of way You, you make me wanna stay in on it you, You're the reason I can't get out of my head I just can't stop thinking about you I just can't stop thinking about you I think it's January 25th, it's Monday. I'm about to go work out, I'm trying to be productive. I It's about 9.30 and I'm upset because I really wanted to you know, get started earlier because I do have some work to do, but um, 
it's okay we go into the gym we move in um and i know i said i don't work out but your girl is really honestly <laughs> trying to work out and don't mind my pack system it looks so rough babe i miss your body you make some kind of fire within me it's almost like it's burning through my skin make myself feel warmer when you're near whenever you need Some brighter days Cause I'm falling in the snow It's getting me deep You make some kind of fire within me It's almost like it's burning through my skin Make myself feel warmer when you're near Whenever you need It's about 10 a.m. It's 9 50. I'm about to head to Ikea because they have the table and chairs in stock that I want. And um, last time I went, which was like a few days ago, they didn't have it. So I'm just gonna hurry up and try and get it and bring it back. All right, made it to Ikea. Gonna try and hurry up and get what I need. Alright, you guys, I secured the um, chairs. Now I need to secure the table. When I was here the last time, they didn't have the base. It looks like they still don't have the base. They do, they got the base. <gasps> yeah. Alright, you guys, so I ended up getting a few different things from IKEA. Say hey, Zane. They said they miss you. I got a few messages saying y'all miss Zane. Say hey. Zane, Zane is adjusting very well to the new space. Um, he only had, let's see, about three accidents. Probably like the first day he got in the new space, he um, did number two. And then I think he did two peas, one in my closet, and then like one by the balcony door. But he's been doing good. He's been adjusting really well. He knows his way around. Hey. But anyway, so... <clears throat> I ended up getting um, a table, like I told you guys I was going to get, and then I also got um, a TV stand. It's a lot, it's a lot of stuff, a lot. 
like a lot of things to put together like as you can see so much stuff so i got this tv stand and we gonna see how it's gonna work when i get so high and drop that thing so low make you sit right here no you can't go back home i'm drank up and i'm banked up and i'm fake fake you bend it down and you poke it up and you elevate it i'm drank up and i'm banked up and i'm fake fake you bend it down and you Still drunk, that's hangover Might run it back when this page over You the best thing, I done slaved over Gone arch you back and been way over It's overdue for that understressing Over him, now you underdressing Call me up and I come finessing Like, ooh, we shot it, what it do, what it don't Baby, you a queen, you can move how you want You was rocking all right good morning beautiful people It is Thursday, January 28th I do apologize that Ah uh, my um, camera it died the other day and then also I ran out of space on my memory card so I wasn't able to record anymore but I um I did go ahead and complete everything that day was very very long so I want to show you guys the finished product and then um I'm gonna talk a little bit about it and make sure like if you haven't already make sure you're following my home page is I design eight home and you'll be able to like catch some of like these pieces as well as like the decoration process before I put it here on uh, YouTube. So make sure you're checking that out and go ahead and follow girl because you know, I'm gonna get into it. And especially when I get my couch, baby, you know, each season, okay, each season, we're going to be decorating. All right, so I am absolutely, just to kind of show you, this is where the TV is at. I am absolutely loving, loving, loving this TV stand. I got it from Ikea, as you guys seen. Um, I'm not exactly sure what the brand is, but I will link it down below. All right, so this TV stand from Ikea is totally customizable. I have like glass here, but if I want to, I can put a shelf right here. I can do glass right there. I can do three drawers here, or a drawer right here, and a drawer right here, and leave this space open with the glass so literally you can customize it however you want to i think this was such a great 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 purchase it was 300 dollars um from ikea 320 i guess to be exact um including taxes and i think it was so well well worth it now do not be alarmed by the reviews the reviews wasn't great but I think the reason why the reviews wasn't so great was because um, of how timely um, this was. It took about five hours to complete. Two people are needed to complete this, um, but it took about five hours to complete. I used a drill and um, I was very steady with the drill. Um, I made sure I had great control over the drill where it wouldn't strip, you know, the nails or the wood or whatever it's called faster with a drill than actually using a um like the little tool that comes with it so i just keep that in mind but if you are using a drill because ikea pieces are delicate pieces i will make sure that you are you know like i said very steady and careful with the drill if you are going to use it i know you guys you guys probably can't even see this is a very sturdy piece like it is super sturdy it is definitely definitely worth the price you get what you pay for and i think this is a very sturdy piece in my opinion i am super happy and satisfied with it i wanted something that will go with my walls but also like my decor and um i can like change it out so if you can see i can put silver i can put gold i can put black and everything so all of this stuff probably won't stay right here um I'm just, I just wanted to put something on it, girl, to get something going, okay? I really absolutely love it, um, but my TV looks so, so, so good um, above it. Like, it just fits so well in the space. And one of the things I love about this so much is that the height, girl, the height, I don't know if you can see, it's at the top of my thigh. Like, the height is what does it for me. And you know, Ikea stuff sometimes is like super duper low. <laughs> Like it literally, like sometimes I kid stuff be like right here and you be like, girl, you know what I mean? So I think um, the extra money came in because of the height. And again, I'm so happy with it. So just to kind of give you a little, little, little tour or whatever, this ain't much girl, but I have the Tom Ford book here. I got this from Amazon. I have not opened it yet. I actually got this for Christmas and I just want to like keep it in the pack for right now. Cause it is, it's not an expensive book, but it's like a hundred dollars and <laughs> 
I, the last time I paid hundred dollars for a book was in college. <laughs> so um, I just want to like keep it into the package until I actually get settled and you know whatever i got these little candles i got these candles probably like two years ago but i got them from ikea they're just for decor i'm not gonna burn them or anything we got miss jackie i know candle right here that i've never burned i've never i got both of her collections i'm not exactly sure which one the first collection and i think the send moods collection i think this is it there for decoration but your girl need to burn it i got this vase here I got this vase here from Target. And then these pompous grass I got from this like little Instagram boutique. It's called Lux B Pompous. And it's just super cute. So now I can show you guys. I just had to pull the blinds down. Um, but this is how the table um, and chairs look that I got from Ikea the other day. Um, so the, t the chairs were $89 a piece and the table was $179. And then I also got these two little things to go on it. So I got these salt and pepper shaker which it doesn't indicate which is which you'll have to like you know indicate yourself it is still in a package because again i'm playing around with things and i want to see if i like it or not so i'm like okay if i don't like i'm gonna take it back so i got these in and, and that's the reason why they're still in the packet and i just threw like a little flower here um and then this little thing i don't know it's like a serving tray or whatever but you can literally do whatever you want with it so i just do that in for right now and then this is just how it looks i absolutely love it it's really giving me like kind of like that boho vibe i'm not exactly sure what i'm going for but yes and i'm thinking maybe a little rug here i'm not exactly sure just yet girl we still playing around with it but this is the table you see the light that's coming through like it's just so nice in the morning whenever i'm drinking coffee or if i'm eating it's just really nice to like look over the city and you know just get views in the morning so with the table i had originally planned to get a table from cb2 and also some chairs that were similar to that but let me tell you girl i spent 179 and then plus 180 i spent about 380 dollars for the two chairs and the table it may seem like a lot which it can be just depending on you know your like what you're going for i love it personally and that's the vibe that i was going for like i really want i didn't want like a big big table again it's just me i don't have a big family or anything like that and i also am not really into like tables like that i wanted something like a very small nook area and that's what it gives me so that's what i went for um i was looking at some tables on uh cb2 and i fell in love with like the bistro the round bistro you know type of tables and i wanted this table on cb2 it was 800 dollars, girl and your girl was gonna get it okay your girl was gonna get it <laughs> and i was also going to get the chairs the chairs was um i think 5.99 or 4.99 and i'm like god dang that's a thousand dollars for two chairs and then the 800 dollars for the table and i'm like okay you know <laughs> do we want to do that do we do we do we okay because it's eighteen hundred dollars for a set i did not plan this was like an out the blue type of moment i did not plan to get the table and chairs from ikea i just happened to go in and i seen this table and i was like this table is really cute like i've been seeing it a lot a lot a lot and i was like it's really really cute and then i seen these chairs and i was like hmm i can like pair these chairs with these ta this table the chairs were nowhere near the table i just decided to go ahead and play around with it and it was it was a whole vibe in my opinion do y'all see that like do you see this i think it's such a whole vibe and i love it and it worked out for me like all right girl so here is the last thing i want to show you that i got and again i'm so sorry no y'all see me put this together you just didn't see me like decorate it i don't think so yeah this is the last thing i want to show you that i put together um <clears throat> what is this a uh, entryway console table that i got from overstock um i don't know how much i paid for this probably like 129 dollars. it was not i don't feel like it was like um expensive at all um but just keep in mind when you get it it is it is very very like wobbly how i fix that is if you see i just added like two little pieces of cardboard underneath which you cannot tell it just looks really good i mean i can like you know pull it in too you see that i can make it look better than it does right here so now it is sturdy and not wobbly anymore so 
that's that i plan to get two little baskets to go under here just haven't found what i want just yet i have this mirror girl and um so i don't like the height of the mirror um i think it's cute for right now you know your girl did it herself oh <laughs> uh, look at the bodysuit okay oh ow girl i'm trying to suck this in and then get this tight little oh body okay but anyway seriously so i got this mirror that i got from target if you guys followed me and kept up with my design this vlog you guys would i did like a little whole little thing on the mirror or whatever put the mirror up i absolutely love it um the only thing about it is i wanted it to be right here do y'all see this line where is that yes this is the line the mirror is down here so I really wanted it up a little bit more and I kind of wanted it to the side a little bit more. But yeah, when my dad came here, he was like, he likes the position. He said, you can see your full outfit. He said that he thinks it looks nice. So I was like, okay, we'll keep it. I hate that they have this behind it, this little electric box right here. But it is what it is, girl. So yeah, this mirror is from Target. I think the mirror was like $80. And um this little bowl here i got from target as well and um i think this bowl was like 40 dollars. i don't know it's a serving dish but i'm just gonna use it for something for my keys and also for um like this little, this little decor right here um these beads that i got here from amazon i got a two pack just in case you're wondering and like i said i'm gonna link everything down below if you're interested I got these um, books here from Restoration Hardware. Literally, girl, they were free, and I just went ahead and like just grabbed what three out of probably like six that they had there. I thought these look aesthetically pleasing, and I mean, it looks really nice. Like they're magazines, but they look really nice. And I got another vase here from Target, and this pompous grass I got from Etsy. I actually need to get another vase because this, I want my pumpus grass to kind of like sit still and not like fly everywhere if you can see, you know what I mean? And then I plan to get like a little light that comes over, over right there is just for decor. I don't need to turn it on. Alright you guys, so I am in Home Goods and I love, love, love this flower arrangement right here, but it's $100 <laughs> and I'm not paying $100 for that. This one gives me the same vibe, this one right here. But that's 30 and it looks very skimped. And I like this one too. Well, I don't know. I just like one of these. These are cute. Oh, <laughs> let me get a, this is super cute, okay. Women when I couldn't stay afloat They ain't never saying nothing Wavy to a boat Like eyes up Look at me Now I'm the captain Brought the camera Time for action Split the legs Just like a fraction Tuck the napkin Time for snacking You a mother meal Tell me that it's mine Baby tell me that it's real Hit it to the max Well tell me how it feel It's gonna be a minute Cause I'm in it for the thrill Make her feel like heaven She gonna put me in the wheel And willingly I wanna do Anything she wanna do I ain't even wanna boo But this is what the karma do It's hard to be apart from all right, you guys, sorry, but my battery's going dead, so I'm gonna have to catch you when I get back to the house. All right, good morning, you guys. It is the next day. I had to charge my batteries for my camera because literally both of them were dead. So I'm going to get into this little haul for you guys. Just go through it quickly so I can put it up because I really wanted to show you guys like what I got yesterday since my camera died yesterday in stores. So we're gonna start with a store that's called World Market. I don't know if you guys know about World Market, but I love, love, love World Market because they have like a lot of great knickknacks. It's kind of like self-care and then they have some really unique pieces. Um, in there, so I love World Market. Got a bunch of candles, but I have two candles here. This is what it looks like. I love, love, love how this looks. Is it focusing? Yeah, so this is what it looks like. I have the bourbon malt and vanilla and the tobacco leaf and amber. I have this one right here, very simplistic packaging, and this is the acacia wood and lavender. And then I have this one right here, also another cute packaging. I love the little wooden top here, or the wooden lid. This is the dandelion and arugula scented candle. I got this detox dead sea salt body scrub. It's charcoal and coconut oil, and I guess jasmine grapefruit right it says yeah jasmine grapefruit so this is what i have right here so i have the charcoal bath salts lavender so it says lavender and rosemary oils um i use this in the bathtub 
coffee exfoliating scrub cream i got it in this they had one more i'm not sure what the other one was but yeah i only got one little like knickknack from um for a market and it's this eyeglass holder it says but it's like all black it's definitely very like my style i won't use it for um <clears throat> i won't use it for eyeglass holder it will more so be just like you know decor but i think it is really nice it looks like a piece of art and it's definitely a conversation starter i got some chopsticks and then i'm not a wine person but i am trying to get more into wine so i got this pacific rim sweet riesling and then i got this wilder merlot all right so now we're going to move on to home goods so starting off with the candles i got two of these candles right here they smell so good and they're called the cloud 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 nine white cedar and lavender and jasmine tea and oid i think that's how you say it i got this eucalyptus candle right here i got this shelter candle right here i love the packaging on this candle like look how simplistic it is but just so cute and again it has this wooden lid I'm here for it mm, smells very sweet too I have two mugs here that I got. One says self-made, the other says hello sunshine. I got this little spear, whatever it's called, thing, it's a little decorative item. I got it to go on my media stand, well inside the media stand, but it is a little bit too big. I also got a wok, I've been wanting a wok, so went ahead and got that. So I got Zane a bed. Um, I got it to go outside. I don't know if he likes it or not, but I think he has to get used to it. He he ain't messing with it though. <laughs> so I got that from Home Goods. All right. So the last place that we went to is Ulta. I got some perfumes. Um, if you guys know, I'm not really into perfumes. Well, I'm not gonna say I'm not into perfumes or whatever, but I'm trying to build my perfume collection. I'm usually getting like body sprays from Bath and Body Works, Victoria's Secret, and you know, just any little thing that I find smell good, you know what I mean? So I'm not really into perfumes, but I'm trying to, you know, be more into the luxurier perfumes, if that makes sense. And I decided to pick up a few perfumes yesterday from Ulta. So I got uh, Chanel, so I got Gabrielle Chanel. Mm. Uh, yeah, so this it smells so good. Um, I got Chance Chanel, I think that's what it is. Um, and then I also got uh, Marc Jacobs Daisy Love. So those are the three perfumes that I'm starting out with. If you guys have any other suggestions on the perfumes that I should try, definitely leave it in the comments below. Um, I like smells that are, I don't mind like a masculine smell, if that makes sense. Um, that's made for women, like I don't mind that. Um, but I do like very fresh smells. I love um, a little bit of a floral smell. I don't like anything that's too sweet, okay? Like I don't like sweet, sweet smells or whatever. I'm open to trying the smell and scents anyway, so leave me comments. Next from Ulta, I got just the alcohol toner. They were buy one, get one 50% off. Got Dr. Teal's. I got this Brigio, but it's a don't despair repair deep conditioning mask. I'm so happy that Ulta got this. Um, they start carrying their collection. And then I got these cotton pads. I just got two because I go through these a lot. The last thing I got was the Tree Hut Sugar Lip. It's a lip scrub. So that's literally everything that I got. All right, you guys, I got a box, a little package. can see it but this is what i ordered <laughs> it's actually really big it's bigger than what i thought it would be and it's supposed to go like right here with some pompous grass in it i'm a little disappointed but and it was a hundred dollars like i wonder if west m would 
because it's not available in stores. And it smells like they spray painted this And it's not as black as I thought it was gonna be. So extra, but I know I'm the same. Love me in spite of my trauma. Give me what I need instead of the drama. Cause when it pop off, it's like, oh my, all good all day, but the night we be going so hard on the flip side. So tell me we'll be on a day, babe. I could keep that same energy. When you go low, I go low too. But you'd rather stay high, I know. Can we stay high? But I do think that this is like really, really pretty. And I wanted to get like some greenery to kind of like stick in there, you know, just to add a little bit of color to it. I think that would be like super pretty. Um, but yeah, like I don't think it's bad. Like I got this vase from West Elm. I may have to just wipe it, but it's given like this ashy black and not this matte, matte black. I thought it was going to be a matte black look or whatever, but I don't know. But I'm not, it's not my favorite, not going to lie about that. It's definitely not a favorite, but I don't really feel like I need to return it. Like I can definitely put it by the media stand or, you know, a mirror that I'm going to get and I think it'll still be a nice look. All right, so I'm moving on to like the next project in my house or whatever, or in my apartment. And um, I'm about to, I'm about to put a new shower head right here. I actually had a shower head on it which was this one um and it actually i've had this shower here for so many years and um i asked the maintenance man to come by and like help me with it because like i put it on there but it was still leaking um so i asked them to help me with it and um one of the maintenance men they came by yesterday but they needed some of that you know i don't know what it's called but whatever it is to kind of like wrap around the pipe again i don't know what it's called but it's something it's like white tape sort of to um keep the water from um leaking or whatever so he came so i didn't have that yesterday so they came back today and he actually broke this piece and you know he offered to uh fix it or whatever but i was like don't worry about it um because it's not even that serious it's a, it's a shower head i'm not that pressed about it so i literally like went online and got a new shower head picked it up from target so this is the one that i got and um hopefully it's better than this one i did like this one i'm not gonna lie you know i'm not upset about it because like i said it's just a shower head like i don't need you to replace a shower head like it's okay it's a water pick power spray plus and it says that it has six sprays and it says that it has um it's an eight foot hose which i don't really care i don't need that long of a hose but whatever i got my grip pliers and pliers take a little cloth i'd rather be on that way trying to control our emotions if we on a rise out of passion we could share love in the ocean But if you wanna go insane Either way, baby, we could go all night We could do it all night We could go all night, all night. Do we heal, do we bleed? I'ma follow your lead But we could go all night Now all of my calls go to voicemail I block you so I don't raise hell Should I talk through it in detail? I separate ways ain't gon' end well No but when we get back, it's like, oh my All bad all day, but the night I Get that good, good till we act right Alright you guys, so I got the shower head and things up And it seems like it's doing good It's not leaking or anything like that So that's good But I'm about to put the eucalyptus in there I got two Branches, or two, yeah, two bunches of eucalyptus I'm only gonna put one Got this off Etsy. I don't like that hose. Like it is too long. My other one, it fit perfectly right here and it was very much secure. This, I don't like.
I could keep that same energy When you go low, I go low too But you'd rather stay high, I know you Can we stay high, babe? I'd rather be on that wave Tryna control our emotions If we on a rise out of passion We could share love in the ocean But if you wanna go insane either way, baby We could go on Cook collected, but you pushing on my nerves And knowing your intention, I'm under pressure Okay, I'm admitting that a couple things I said Got acidic in the tone and the presence I get careless Long as you know, I come with imperfections When you look at me, you see the sun